Delmar College continued its expansion today with the official opening of the General Academic Music Building on the Heritage Campus and the naming of its courtyard. The center plaza was dedicated to an English professor who taught there for four decades. Brandon Schaff was at the ceremony and is here now with more. Brandon? That is right, Mike. The facility has four interconnected buildings with a plaza right there in the center, and it is something to behold. Today, Del Mar named that plaza for the late professor Mike Anzaldia, and for generations of his students, this symbolizes what Anzaldia stood for throughout his 43-year career. I salute the Del Mar College Board of Regents for the beautiful way you have honored Mike Moses Anzaldua Jr. Delmar College Bridge passed with present today, officially naming a new courtyard for longtime professor Mike Anzaldia. This is the central part of the school's $45 million expansion, which finished just before the pandemic. The original uh, design from this building stems from 2014 and efforts for the community that supported uh, an opportunity to build something like this. And so, if you, as you can imagine, 2014 forward, we finally get it built. Um, we had to shut it down because of COVID. The expansion added more than 127,000 square feet of building space, plus the courtyard. It opened just before the pandemic, which delayed the dedication for a beloved professor for two years. He loved his students. Uh, he definitely is being honored in a very appropriate way with this plaza that encourages students and faculty to meet and uh, converse about work, about life. Mike embodied that, that nurturing spirit and, and soul that it really uh, embodied um, uh, support, care, and love for our students. And so to be able to name this plaza uh, in his honor uh, was a tremendous honor for us. The additions to the Heritage Campus comes as Del Mar College continues construction on its new Oso Creek Campus that's scheduled to open in a limited capacity in the summer or early fall. There too uh, is another uh, fantastic commitment um, of our community to uh, to our students and, and for the generations to come. That's what this is about. This is about multiple genera for generations into the future that'll outlive us all. And this massive expansion of our community college comes thanks to a 2014 bond. And as for Mike Azadua, his legacy lives on in other ways too. After his death in 2012, his family donated $400,000 in scholarships in English, music, and Mexican-American studies. Mike? All right, fantastic way to remember him. Thank you, Brandon.